another Animal Ray's Kitchen. Today we're going to teach you a special holiday treat. As you know, some of the best recipes come out of Christmas time and the holiday season. One of those is eggnog. Today we're going to teach you how to make my special blend of eggnog. Eggnog has been around for hundreds and thousands of years. And it's one of my favorite drinks because it's so versatile. You can use it for so many different ingredients and use it in so many different things. Eggnog, as you know, is a combination of various different ingredients. Today, we're going to learn what those ingredients are and how to use those to make a great eggnog. One of the first ingredients is eggs. Eggs are essential in eggnog. Another ingredient is cream. Today we're using grade A light cream, ultra pasteurized by ShopRite. ShopRite, get the right shop for your dollars. And sugar. Sugar is a necessary ingredient as well. Make sure that your container says sugar. If your container says flour, you're probably going to have eggnog that tastes too floury and not enough sugary. Another necessary ingredient is a wide variety of spices. Spices are what really gives the eggnog its distinct taste and what can give you a distinct special ingredient for your eggnog. Today I'm going to teach you a special secret ingredient, spice mix, that's going to make your eggnog taste extra special. So let's begin. First, we're going to take our egg and we're going to crack it. Make sure that you put the inside of the egg inside of the bowl, not the shell part. The next ingredient we need is cream. Make sure you use an entire cup of cream or else you won't have creamy enough eggnog. The next ingredient is of course sugar. Again, to reiterate, make sure your sugar container says sugar on it and not flour. Flour would give you floury eggnog and we want sugary eggnog. You want one teaspoon of sugar. Make sure you use the long teaspoon handle if you have a deep container. Spread it evenly throughout your mix. Now, the best part. This is very secret, so make sure you keep this to yourself. This is my secret ingredient. Combination of, of spices. One chair spoon of onion powder. One yellow cup of cumin. One white cup of allspice. Another yellow cup of garlic powder. A pinch of chili powder. Cinnamon, cayenne powder, you can go heavy on this part, it really adds a great taste to it. A tablespoon of chili powder. Basil. and parsley flakes. Parsley flakes are the final ingredient and it's very important that you use one of the white things to measure it. Now comes the best part. Make sure you mix it very well. I like to use a combination of a spatula and a mixing thing. Ah, 
This looks delightful. So refreshing. You can see the texture and the color starting to come out now. I think that's mixed well enough now. Now that you have your eggnog all mixed up, go over and drop it in the trash. Then go to your fridge, get out a carton of eggnog, pour it into your favorite cup, and enjoy. Ah. Now that we have it all stirred up, it's time to put it in the oven. Make sure you only leave it in the oven for long enough. You should heat the oven to 500 minutes. It's about ready now. Now, for my secret ingredient, the secretest of all secret ingredients, add some eggnog. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> Now that it's all stirred up, it's time to put it in the fridge to let it chill. Since we thought ahead, we already made some eggnog and had it chill already for us. So now, pour it in the glass. Enjoy. Mm. Now that I'm done stirring, it's time for our second stir. Today we have a special guest, my new assistant, Jay Sososo, from Fridays. He's on the Fridays kitchen staff. Jay Sososo, would you help stir us? Now make sure that you use the small table teaspoon when you stir the second time. I'm glad I have an assistant so that I can use my time more efficiently. How's it going, Jason Sosa? While he's stirring, I can always be cleaning up. But I don't really feel like doing that. So, I'm just going to go and watch the latest game of football. Let me know when you're done stirring. Well, sugar is a necessary ingredient. This has sugar on so no <laughs> sugar. <laughs> Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs>